Log into Enterprise and expand Supplier Management on the tree and click on Add New Supplier. Enter the first three to four letters of the supplier you want to add and then click the blue search arrow. The wizard searches the Fourth Hospitality database of over 5,000 suppliers. Select the supplier you want to add from the list, check in their details to ensure you are adding the correct supplier to the organization. You have the option to choose which site in your organization you wish to add this supplier, but we suggest you select no sites and then click finish at the bottom. Click OK at the prompt and then close the wizard. Once a supplier is added, you can then set some organization specific information. Click on the supplier that you've just added from the list and then click on the edit details tab at the top. Enter your nominal code for your supplier and then enter any minimum order amount or quantity ensuring the box is ticked to block orders below this amount. You can also enter a maximum order amount again ensuring to tick the box to block orders over that amount. Tick the relevant boxes for the delivery days unique to your organization and any cutoff times. When you have finished, click on Save Changes. The updated information will now appear on the General tab under the Shipping Information. Next, click on the Issuing Depot tab, which will show you details of the different supplier depots across the country. Find the depots that your sites order from and check the details are correct. Now move across to the Where Used tab and click on Add Supplier to Site. From the wizard, expand the units within your organization and simply tick the sites you wish to add this supplier to. You have the option of selecting different depots for each site. When you are finished, click on Step 2 and then select Finish. Click OK at the prompt and close the wizard. Notice that this supplier is now added to two sites with different ordering depots for each site. If there is different supply information for the different depots, such as the cutoff time for example, then you will need to adjust these at site level. Log into the site and click on Manage Suppliers and then select the supplier. Click on Edit at the top and make any changes here and when you have finished click on save. 